Greetings. Thank you so much for joining us today as we take a few moments to just consider the Word of God and turn our hearts towards Him and I uh, pray together. Yesterday we looked at Malachi 4 too, where the prophet said, For those who fear my name, the Son of Righteousness will arise with healing in His wings. I want to focus on that aspect, righteousness. Very specifically, he says, the son of righteousness. So he's, he's, he's you know, using this picture of the rising sun and the sunlight, the beams of the sunlight coming into our life. And he's really talking about those beams of being beams of righteousness or rays of righteousness. So God is going to shine righteousness into our lives. So he's going to rise up like the sun. His light is going to flood our lives even though there's darkness around because we fear His name. But He's saying these, these rays, these beams will be beams of righteousness. Now very interestingly, in the Old Testament, when the, the scriptures use the word righteousness, it is a word that, is also, that also means justice and also talks about the goodness of God. So it's not only just God being a righteous God and God wanting us to walk in righteousness, doing what's right, but he's, He is a God of justice who will do justice for us. And also it's an expression of His goodness. And out of His goodness, righteousness and justice are released into our lives. Psalm 103 verse 6 says, The Lord executes righteousness and justice for all who are oppressed. Psalm 37 6, He will bring forth your righteousness as the light and your justice as the noonday. So what's he saying? God's light is going to cause righteousness to break forth, justice to take place in our lives. And that's what I want to pronounce over you. Wherever there has been injustice, unfairness, unrighteousness done to you, the Lord will shine His light, causing His righteousness, His justice, His goodness to flood your life. Receive it. Be expectant for God's righteousness, justice, and goodness to break forth in your life. Let's pray. Father, we thank You for Your Word, which says that for us who fear Your name, the Son of Righteousness will arise. So Father, let your rays and beams of righteousness light up our life, flood our lives, causing, Lord, your righteousness, your justice, your goodness to be released in our lives. Everywhere there has been unrighteousness, injustice, or God, uh, evil being done. Let your light shine forth in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.